The rose reading goes back to ancient Greece. The smell of roses fills sacred spaces all over the world, so it's only a matter of time be before people start using them for divination. How easily it allowed us to connect with our higher self, and the results have been really astonishing. The reading kind of takes people on a journey. There's a transformational aspect to it that is really unique. People will use the entire rose, the whole blossom. Okay. They can use it to uh, access past lives as like a hypnotic, meditative kind of situation, which I use a little bit in my reading. We're able to identify certain traits that the person has, the certain path. It's almost like a map that we're looking at with the chart and the petals. From there, being able to ascertain what the best steps are we need to take to get to the goal that we want. We end with a, with a dream ritual, which is one of the big standouts in the readings that, that people come back and talk to me about all the time. I really feel an important duty of a reader to empower people's quests.